Well, I've made it to the mouth of Montreal. That's behind me. We'll go check it out. This is at the top of the falls, right by the mouth of the Montreal. One thing I remember as a child walking through these woods is an incredible cedar smell. To this day, it's one of my favorite smells and I only smell it really up here. When I'm here, I become magical. I can disappear. I'm simply amazed by this country up here. You can walk for miles and miles and miles. The trails are kind of like an enchanted forest. <laughs> enchanted forest. Enchanted forest. With little like holes and little burrows and stuff that you see. Really quite quiet. Something about the Huanau Forest. That's just so beautiful. I love it up here. I mean, check out this, this tree. I mean, look at the size of this tree. Simply amazing up here. Check out that view. Have little rock caverns everywhere. They're almost like little caves. You can kind of go way deep inside of them. Here I am in the Keweenaw. I'm camping to camp all by myself way out in the wilderness. Uh, I set up, set up a camp here amongst these trees, and then there's the beach right there. Fire's crackling. It's very quiet out here. It's just so quiet and no city life, you know? I don't know why I do this. Because there's times like this, the sun's going down right now. It's gonna be pitch black soon. I've got my tent. It is super still, silent. <laughs> and then I go, what was I thinking? I survived the night in the wilderness. And uh, look at this view that you wake up to. Oh, how nice that is. Norman, the loons. Oh, that sounds neat, doesn't it? This is what I'm talking about, people. You gotta get out here and experience this stuff. It's magical, it's amazing. It rejuvenates the soul, it really does. Mm -hmm.